contrast swing of cricket ball. This is the cricket ball and we can denote the direction of initial flight of the ball. And uh, we can denote the seam of the cricket ball. And uh, this seam of the cricket ball is kept straight up, not angled. That means the seam of the cricket ball is kept straight up and it is not angled with respect to the right-handed batsman. Seam is kept straight up, not angle. And uh, the smooth side is placed uh, on the offside and the rough side is pointing towards leg side. Air is flowing in the opposite direction. And we can denote the boundary layer touching the smooth side. A is a point of separation and in this way air flows touching the smooth side of the cricket ball. This is the air flow. Air is flowing in the opposite direction and there will be turbulent flow. The boundary layer touching the smooth surface will be in turbulent state and on the other side that means uh, uh, air will be flowing touching the rough side maintaining turbulent uh, flow again. B is a point of separation from which the turbulent weak turbulent boundary layer is separated from uh, the ball. This is uh, the weak turbulent boundary layer and uh, there will be strong uh, turbulent boundary layer touching the smooth side of the cricket ball and on this boundary layer lower pressure P1 will be acting and higher pressure will be acting on the rough side of the cricket ball. Boundary layer will be separated from the cricket ball from the point A lately and a lateral force F acts towards left and the ball will swing towards offside. That means the ball swings uh, towards smooth side of the cricket ball. Ball swings uh, towards the smooth side of the cricket ball. That is contrast swing. For But for conventional uh, outswing, the ball swings towards offside uh, with respect to the opposite end of the smooth side. When a cricket ball, when a cricket ball is thrown in air, when a cricket ball is thrown in air with much higher speed, greater than 70 km per hour, 70 mile per hour, that is greater than when a cricket ball is thrown in air with much higher speed under bracket greater than 70 mile per hour that is 120 km per hour with its sim with its sim straight up not angle with respect to right handed batsman such that such that its smooth side such that its smooth side is kept towards offside and rough side towards leg side of a right-handed batsman. The ball is thrown with much higher speed with its seam straight up, not angle, such that smooth side is kept towards offside and the upside is kept towards leg side of a right-handed batsman. And the boundary layer of airflow, the boundary layer of the airflow touching the smooth side of the ball, touching the smooth side of the ball on the offside pointing towards offside will be in strong turbulent state. The boundary layer of air uh, flowing, the boundary layer of air flow uh, touching the smooth side of the ball will be in strong turbulent state, which separates later, which separates later in comparison with the weak turbulent boundary layer with in comparison with the weak turbulent boundary layer of air touching its rough side. Also, hence a higher pressure, hence a higher pressure and lower pressure will be acting, will be acting on the rough side and smooth side respectively. Higher pressure and lower pressure will be acting on the rough side and smooth side of the cricket ball respectively. 
lateral force F equal P2 minus P1 into A that is pressure difference into area of cross section of the wall X towards X towards left with respect to the ball and the ball swings media ball swings in media towards the smooth side ball swings mid air towards the smooth side of the cricket ball that means the ball swings towards uh, off side of a right handed batsman towards off side of a right handed batsman now we can compare reverse swing and contrast swing reverse swing and contrast swing for reverse swing the seam is angled towards offside of a right handed batsman seam is angled towards offside of a right handed batsman or towards seam is pointing towards first slip fielder of a right handed batsman for reverse swing seam is kept straight up that means the seam is not angled the seam of the cricket ball is kept straight up that means not angled for contrast swing on the left hand side for reverse swing rough side is pointing towards left side and uh, smooth side is pointing towards off side off side similarly for uh, um, contrast swing rough side is pointing towards left side and smooth side is pointing towards off side for reverse swing on the left hand side strong turbulent strong turbulent flow will be there touching the rough side and uh, or and also here weak turbulent boundary layer will be there on the seam side of the cricket ball for contrast swing on the right hand side weak turbulent flow uh, will be on the rough side and strong turbulent flow will be on the smooth side of the cricket ball the strong turbulent flow will be on the smooth side of the cricket ball here for a reverse swing higher pressure is acting on the seam side or higher pressure is acting on the smooth side of the cricket ball and lower pressure will be acting towards left on the rough side or lower pressure will be acting on the non seam side of the cricket ball lateral force f will be acting towards leg side and the ball swings towards leg side uh, of a right handed batsman and for contrast swing on the right hand side lower pressure will be acting on the smooth side and higher pressure will be acting on the rough side as a result a lateral force f will be acting from rough side to smooth side of the cricket ball means uh, lateral force f acts towards left and the ball swings away with respect to right handed batsman for reverse swing the ball swings against the direction of seam position the ball swings against the direction of seam position and here uh, for contrast swing the ball swings towards the ball swings towards the smooth side of the cricket ball the ball swings towards the smooth side of the cricket ball